Hey guys, Alex here, hvnashville.com. So what I want to talk about is getting qualified for a mortgage. Um, basically, there's a couple different parameters that come into play. And I bring this up because as most of you know, usually when I bring up a different topic, it's because something has happened recently, maybe some questions, something of that nature. So when you're looking to buy a home, you got to ask yourself a couple things. One, do I pay my bills on time? To where somebody's going to loan me 80, 100, 200, 300, $400,000. Um, have I shown a good payment history that would justify somebody giving me that kind of money in order to purchase a home? Because keep in mind, buying a home is not a right. It is an opportunity. Now, all of us deserve an opportunity, but we don't necessarily have the right to buy a home. So ask yourself, do I make my payments on time? Would I lend myself how many hundreds of thousands of dollars that you're looking at? The next thing, down payments. Yes, there are down payment assistance programs. There's a lot that goes into them. I'm not going to discuss them here. Down payment assistance programs are great for certain people looking for certain situations. I would never take that from anybody. But if you make $100,000 a year and you can't get 3.5% down to buy a new home, you got to look at those finances again and decide if you're actually doing the right things with your money in order to afford a home. And I say that because I'm talking to a guy right now just before we got on, on this video. He's putting $112,000 down on a house. He's got the money sitting in the bank. He's no different than you are, than I am, than anybody else is. The only difference is, is he budgeted different, he puts some money aside and he's able to have that money. Um, he may have worked a little bit harder than some of us, but that's neither here nor there. So ask yourself, do I have the money to put down? If you don't and you're in a situation where maybe uh, you're taking care of other people, maybe elders, maybe siblings, maybe children, something like that, and it's hard to come buy that money because you're squeezing out all your money to pay bills, that's understandable. And in that situation, maybe a down payment loan is something, a down payment assistant loan is something that works for you. Other things I want to talk about is stability of job. Now, if you have had six, seven different jobs, or maybe you're a waiter or a waitress, and you claim that you made 275 an hour plus six bucks a day in tips, we have to be able to prove that income. So the IRS, we're gonna look at their tax returns and we're gonna say, okay, does this make sense? Did this person show that they made $30,000 a year or $3,000 a year? That's what we have to qualify most people off of. So make sure that if you're, you're looking to purchase a home, you stay steady on the job that you have. You don't say, you know what, screw this. I'm not gonna be a waitress anymore, I'm gonna start my own restaurant. And then open up your own business and two months later try to get a loan. Um, those are just a couple things I wanna to toss out there that'll help people get qualified. The other thing is, today, I've got an awesome podcast. I'm trying to get it uploaded. I got to upload it here in the next couple of minutes. My buddy Rich from the Rap Lab had an opportunity to sit here with him today. He got to listen, or he got to, to run through, and uh, we BS back and forth, but he was also looking at starting a podcast and wanted to get some fillers out there on how to do things. So, awesome podcast coming up here today, 5 o'clock, 5.05 maybe. <laughs> but it'll be on there. Check it out, ajnashville.com. You can go and click my podcast. Also, you can find me now on SoundCloud, iTunes, and I am looking to expand to Google Play if I can get a confirmation email. That thing's a mess. So any questions or anything on there? Anything crazy? Not yet. Not yet? Good. Thank God. Anyways, happy Monday, guys. Hope everything's going well. We'll talk to you soon.